Yo, what's up, guys? I'm back at it again with another video today, and I'm um, I'm out here today with some a skateboard and a penny board. I went back inside my house and grabbed my pink penny board, pink for cancer, and my skateboard. I haven't rode these in a long time, and I'm gonna show you how to ride one of these. foot where all three of the screws are underneath your foot and there's only one screw out all right you don't want it like this otherwise it's gonna be like that and then you're gonna have a hard time riding it and you don't want it like this otherwise you're gonna lean too much to the right and then your wheels are gonna pick up and go like that so you have to put your foot on the three screws right here Make sure that it's tilted at a 90 degree angle. And what you want to do for your foot is that you want to have it like this. You want to have two screws left out. Don't make it like the other foot. And then you kick it. Then you just want to kick it. I don't want to just put my foot in the back. So like if, I'm, if I'm about to crash into anything. I could just pick it up, you know, have it like this. You know, I'm ready to stop. My foot's there. It's ready to stop and everything else. But what you want to do is that just give it a little push. You know, you, got, you have to have really, really good balance for this. Because it wobbles like really, 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 really wobbles like, it wobbles like crazy. Guys, wobbles really, really crazy. And um, um, on another video, I did make I did make another video on how to untighten and untighten the skateboard and the penny board. So you know, like if a wheel's broken, you can replace it. And wheels are not that expensive. They're kind of expensive, but not that much. Like it might cost you about like forty or fifty bucks to repair it. Well, the whole penny, the whole skateboard and penny board, it's gonna cost you. But this one, this one is different than the penny board. This one has all this, has like this pattern. This one looks like it just has rocks. And that's to have your feet have a good grip, you know? Like at the bottom of your foot. You know how like you have this part here? It's for a good grip. You know, like you're not sliding in anything. The penny board, the penny board's a different story. Like, yeah, you also get a good grip, but you kind of slide a little bit. See, look, my foot's like this. See, look, I can move my foot. And um, the penny board, it's kind of hard to bend it. See, look. It's hard to bend it, but for a skateboard, it's really, really easy to bend. All you have to do to break, like, a skateboard is just, like, jump on it from, like, a wall or, or drop something heavy on it. But for a penny board, I'm pretty sure you're going to have to drop, like, about... Like, all right, the plastic's about like this thick and the skateboard is about like that thick. Penny board, this thick. Skateboard, that thick. Because the skateboard is made out of wood. This is made out of plastic. It's also harder to ride. Like, look, I don't ride it normally. Look, I put my foot exactly like the rest, but as you can see, there's no stop. Like, you can't just stop. You have to... I put my foot like this, like a normal, as you can see. But it's really, really tiny. It's not that spacious. And look, my foot's different on the penny board in the back. That's to get a good grip and balance on it. 
there's one it's basically kind of like this one but on the opposite side there should be one screw left on it you guys all right there's one screw that should be left on the penny board while you're riding shoot all right Alrighty, I almost fell. I almost hurt myself. I forgot you tie your shoes. Oh, it, it caught on my shoelace. And what I use for a talking piece now, you guys, is an earpiece that I have. I've always had it. I got it when I graduated from. Sixth grade. I'm heading into eighth right now. I am actually in eighth grade, but I haven't started school yet. I say hey, you do well in school. Oh. oh shoot! It's harder to ride. The penny board is harder to ride. Look. Okay. Like you go too far back. You're gonna. You're gonna trigger this thing. It's gonna go flying back like this. It's kind of like a little stop, but like, like, this is a good size for me. But like, it's hard to stop. Like, you would have to just like, like if you have a thing of grass, if you're riding and you don't know how to stop, you would have to go into the grass. Just keep your balance. Try to keep your balance or jump off when there's grass. But obviously you also have a, to have a stretch in. I recommend that you should try like using a skateboard first before you move on to a penny board. That's what I recommend. Cause it's really, really hard to ride one of these things. <laughs> yeah, but all in all that's that. This is how to ride a skateboard in under eight minutes but ac signing out peace make sure that you like comment and subscribe ac signing out peace